Hey folks, welcome to my kingdom or welcome back to my kingdom. If you're returning, thank you for existing. Um, sorry that I look like this. <laughs> this is what I looked like whenever I realized that I'm going to be vending an event tomorrow. I'm going to be vending my friend's rave. It's a charity event called Base for Kids. He asked me last minute to bring the candy corner um it's right over there i'm getting it like packed up and ready to go and to bring some of my vending stuff so that i could sell some stuff and i decided that i'm gonna donate half of my earnings but yeah that's tomorrow today is thursday tomorrow is friday um i decided that i'm gonna start this uh realistic work day in my life today since technically the work starts today so um yeah i'll be uh making a video for tomorrow and i'll be uh vending as well as helping people make candy and um just helping my friend with his event i'm really excited uh yeah hope you enjoyed today's video don't forget to like and subscribe it really helps out a lot and if you want to comment i love having conversations with y'all in, in the comment section but yeah anyway let's get into the video we got free gum and glow sticks for everybody five dollar chokers i only brought some of my inventory um pendants are 20. Some more candy right here and a bunch of decorations and like things like table runners, a take one leave one box, a bunch of coloring books for people who don't really like to make candy. Um, I have a list for the candy corner. I thought that they like looked childish. You know, they kind of look like stuffed animals. Uh, they were my Valentine's Day decorations, but I think that they can work for base for kids as well. Um, and then I have like a bunch of extra just random stuff. We have masks, like face masks left over from Wub Dub. I decided I'm bringing them because like why not? Uh, a bunch of hand sanitizer, LED lights, strobe lights, twinkle lights with ivy on it, business card holder if anybody needs it, um, my king castle tapestry, uh, yeah, some random stuff that I like to throw. Like, if you just, like, do stuff like this, this is fabric, actually, but, um, it had satin on the back of it, but I, it was left over, and every time I go out, pieces of it fall off, but it's worth using, because whenever, whenever you get, like, lights hitting off of it, people will just flock to your shit, just because of this, this little, this thing, so yeah, it's perfect. So, basically, all I have to do now is write some player fortunes for tomorrow. These are just, like, little... You already saw them if you watched my, like, music promoter and club promoter video whenever I was getting ready for Love Dub. I wrote a bunch of heart-shaped ones. But these are just, like, positive little pieces of advice for people that I give to people. People get really excited about them, actually. We ran out at Love Dub, and um, people were coming up to me, like, where are the player fortunes? And I was like, they are gone. good morning folks it is rave day um i woke up a little bit ago i showered i tried to eat but on days like this i get like too manic uh to do anything except for like get ready for the party and then i usually like eat right before i go but yeah i'm gonna finish getting ready for the rest of the day and clean up the house a little bit uh i'm excited for later can't wait to take y'all to work with me <laughs> but yeah we actually got a bunch of new uranium glass I'm not even going to bring that into this episode. Last time, I literally, like, talked about uranium glass in, like, a, a whole 20-minute video. If y'all want a uranium glass video, just let me know. Me and Tyler would love to make one. We already talked about making, like, a little uranium glass tour video together, and he's down for it. So, yeah. Hope y'all enjoy this video. Thanks for being here. <laughs> 
God, I can't believe I forgot to show you all this. I probably need some new batteries for tonight. That's like the only thing that I don't have in here. But um, it's my little suitcase where I'm supposed to be. This is like my vending suitcase for whenever I go to festivals that don't have vendors so that you can just like kind of pull out your suitcase and vend at somebody's campsite. Um, and I set it up in here, like whatever I have, I just set it up in here and I put my extra stuff in these pockets. And then I put a liner at the bottom, like this little, uh, like go to Joanne Fabrics or a fabric store and just get a pretty fabric. It's where I got this fabric as well. It's like just a bunch of stars, they're really faint, you can't even tell. Um, and then these are pillowcases that I put over like a tin box that used to have cookies in it. And I use it as a display. Um, my old friend gave me this, like these little displays, they're just shelves from Walmart covered in duct tape. And then this is from the dollar store, and then I just put, I made a cardboard thing, and then I have my paintings in here. Um, I'm not really a painter, but I do make paintings occasionally. And then I have a board with all of my links on it so people can add me. And then I have my sewed, my hand sewed bags over here, my business card holder. And then, yeah, I, I'll show you what it looks like. It usually looks pretty cool, but I have this. Um, I have this because um, I don't have a thing that says my name on it, so I kind of need something that says my name on it that people will recognize. So I use the suitcase because it's pretty, you know, uh, nobody else that I've seen has used a suitcase as part of their setup. So, um, yeah, people remember me, like, with this thing, kind of. <laughs>
so I just sold another pair of earrings out the door. Random shit that I just didn't even have on display. Somebody asked to see them and I sold them a pair. So that felt good. But yeah, I'm leaving at like almost 2 a.m. Tired, Tyler's tired, he's somewhere back there. <laughs> good morning, y'all. It's the next day. I'm probably gonna do some door dashing later. Um, I totaled up all of my shit. I made about like 60 bucks yesterday. I donated 20 bucks because I ended up buying myself food and drinks at the show and they were using the food vendor money to donate as well. And I definitely bought like three orders of pot stickers and an order of ramen. So I was, <laughs> I was like, this is donation money. It's going into my belly. <laughs> I'm so excited. So it was good food. It was good vibes the whole night. The candy corner was lit and packed all night. My cats are like screaming. They want to go outside so bad. Um, yeah, but I'm probably going to do some door dashing later. I'm going to write some player fortunes for that too. Um, and stick them on there. And um, I'm probably gonna do some door dashing tomorrow as well. Uh, me and Tyler go together. He drives and I like make sure the shit doesn't fall over and put little notes on it. And then I um, help him find the house numbers because it's kind of hard to like find the house numbers. It's good to have an extra set of eyes on it so you can be like, where the fuck is this house at? You know what I mean? But yeah. Um, hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Yeah, I love you guys. Thank you for existing.